I'm Jim Van Zeeland, Piping Superintendent of Team Industries. We have multiple industries. Early on, we started off in pulp and paper, brewery, kind of moved into power industries, refinery, petrochemical, mining, and multiple other ones. It's all about doing it right the first time. That's just probably our biggest thing we look at. We can't fail x-rays, we can't have rework. Anything coming back against the grain, you, you, you lose your production, and that's what we're not about here. We are using exclusively Miller welding machines, roughly 50% Pipeworks welders. With the Pipeworks welder, we will uh, use a TIG root, flux fill and cover, or even TIG out, whether it's stainless or carbon, depending on what pipe we're welding. The training, they get up to speed quicker. It's ease of operation. It works very nice for switching back and forth. We have seen a decrease in x-ray failure. I like the, how simple it is. Easy changeover. I love the SD card. I put my own settings in just the way I like it every day. If you can weld with another machine, you can definitely weld with this one because it's, it's the simplest one I've ever used. One touch of a button, you can go from TIG, MIG, flux core, and grab that gun, hit the wire, and you're ready to roll. I don't have to remember to change my polarity or my leads. I can hit the pedal and be on a different process immediately. I know the guys that weren't running them, they would get on a Pipeworks and they're like, I gotta have one of these. We're using the Hobart Megafill wire down in our shop. Basically the reason we started using it was because of the H4 requirement, AWS, and we had a customer that required the H4 designation. Found out it's worked very well. The benefits of the wire are, are the H4, obviously lower moisture, so we don't have to worry about porosity as much. We've failed less x-rays because of porosity problems because of the H4 requirement. We've been using the ProHeat since it came out. That was another product that we demoed here and helped Miller out develop. We probably have 10 pro heat machines here. Very user friendly for the welders. Doesn't take much training to get them to be able to preheat and post heat. They've also developed a rolling inductor for the pro heat, which we use a lot for preheating. And the pro heat helps our productivity by bringing the piece up a temperature much quicker. The consistency of the heat is very uniform across the pipe. Instead of getting hot spots by flame heating, we're getting uniform heat all the way around the pipe. Now we, we really don't want to use open flame at all anymore. Definitely a safety factor there, time savings, just all around great product for us. For us, the relationship with Miller, they're always out front and uh, we depend on them to keep us uh, in the driver's seat as far as the new uh, advancements so that um, we're deal always dealing with new equipment.